Hello everyone, this is Dr. Surya. So today we are going to see one more problem on most economical rectangular channel. So before that, just read the problem. A rectangular channel 4 meter wide has a depth of water of 1.5 meter. The slope of the bed is given as 1 in 1000 and the C value with chassis constant is 55. So it is desired to increase the discharge to a maximum by changing the dimensions of the section for constant area of cross section, slope of the bed and roughness of the channel. Find the new dimensions of the channel and increase in discharge. So this is a problem given to us. So first of all a problem is given. Just read the problem very carefully. So the first thing is that they have given the depth, they have given the width, they have given the slope as well as they have given the chassis constant also. After that if you see they are going to increase the discharge to the maximum. So initially it was a rectangular channel and after that it is going to become a most economical rectangular channel. So what they are doing is that we have to change the dimensions of the section. So what they are going to do, they are going, we have to find the new dimensions. Means we have to find the new dimensions of width and depth if the channel is going to be the most economical rectangular section. And for that they have given the condition that the area go is going to remain the same, slope is going to remain the same and also the roughness is also going to remain the same. And later we have to get what is the increase in discharge. So increase in discharge means there should be two discharge should be there and uh, we have to get the difference in discharge. So we will go to the problem one by one. So first initially it is going to be a rectangular channel. So first we will write the given data. So uh, they have given the B as 4. D is going to be 1.5, slope is going to be 1 by 1000 and C is equal to 55. So this is what is given to us. So initially uh, the formula, what are the formulas we will be using for our rectangular channel means area will be equal to BD and wetted perimeter will be equal to B plus 2D and to get the discharge we will be using the formula Q is equal to AC into root of S R naught. So these are the formulas we are going to use. Okay, now we will go back to the solution. So first I will be determining my area of the rectangular section. So I will subdivide the part into two. So the first part we are going to uh, get for the normal rectangular channel. So which is my area will be equal to 4 into 1.5 that is the formula is B into D. So which is equal to 6 meter square. Next I will be getting my wetted perimeter P is equal to B plus 2D that is 4 plus 2 into 1.5 which is equal to 7 meter. Next I will get my discharge Q is equal to AC into root of RS naught. Okay, so for that R value is going to be, uh, so we have to get the write the formula for R also, R is equal to area by wetted perimeter. Okay, so this Q is equal to, instead of A I can write 6, instead of C I will be writing 55, instead of R which is nothing but A by P, so A is 6 meter square, P is 7 and S naught value is given in the problem that is 1 by 1000. Okay, so just if I am calculating, I will be getting the discharge Q is equal to 9.66 meter cube per second. So my first part of the problem is over, I have calculated my discharge. Now coming back to the second part, so now we are moving back to our second, uh, second part, that is what we are going to do. So see in the problem, we are going to increase the discharge to the maximum and we are going to change the dimensions of the section. So we have to what we are going to do we are going to second part is we are going to increase the discharge to the maximum. So that is Q is going to be increased and that will be a maximum value and all your uh, constant will be your you will be keeping your area slope and roughness as constant okay this is the condition. Okay, now what I am going to do is that I am going to imagine that let B dash be the new width of channel. Because I have to get the dimensions, right? So if I have to get the dimensions, that is B and D has to be got. So D dash be the new depth of channel. Okay, now what will be my area? Area is 
b dash into d dash that will be the formula but it is given that we are going to adapt a constant area which means the area is value is not going to change so already we know that the area what we have determined is 6 meter square so this is not going to change so 6 will be equal to b dash d dash so let me keep this as equation 1 and we know the condition right for uh, the channel to be the economical section we are having two conditions that is b b is equal to 2d since because we are representing it as b dash and d dash i can write it as b dash is equal to d 2d dash and r is equal to d dash by 2 so these are the conditions for your most economical rectangular section now i have calculated my uh, b dash is equal to I know the condition b dash is equal to 2 d dash so instead of uh, this b dash d dash is equal to 6 instead of b dash I will be substituting 2 d dash into d dash is equal to 6 which is 2 d dash square is equal to 6 and I will be getting my uh, 2 this and this will get cancelled so d dash square is equal to 3 so d dash will be equal to root 3 that is going to be 1.732 meter so the new depth of my channel is going to be 1.732 meter and as per the condition b dash is equal to 2 into d dash which is equal to 2 into 1.732 my b dash value will be 3.464 so i have determined the new dimensions so the new dimensions of the channel will be with this equal to 3.464 meter and depth is equal to 1.732 meter okay now they have asked one more question in the problem that is get the value of increase in discharge which means i have to get the value of q dash also so the formula for q dash will be a into c into root of r into s naught so if you know here a is going to be the constant one which is going to be 6 c value is also it's going to be a constant one which is going to be 55 s naught value is also constant which is going to be 1 by 1000 and we are having a condition for r for the most economical rectangular section that is r is equal to d by 2 here it becomes d dash by 2 my d dash by 2 will be 1.732 by 2 which is equal to 0.866 meter okay so q dash will be equal to i just substitute the value 6 into 55 into root of 0.866 into 1 by 1000 so i am getting the value for q dash as 9.71 meter cube per second now they have asked me to get the value for increase in discharge which means which discharge will be maximum the channel the most economical rectangular channel should contain the maximum discharge so if you check here this is the most economical channel section that is 9.71 and one more discharge what we have got earlier is going to be uh, see in the problem which is 9.66 comparatively it is lesser than that of your most economical section so if there is an increase in discharge i have to subtract that is q dash minus q that is 9.71 minus 9.66 which is equal to 0.05 meter cube per second so there is an increase in discharge of about 0.05 meter cube per second okay hope you understood thank you and happy learning